Hello everybody. I know it's difficult to smile in this time of crisis, but the entire world is uh, is down with this crisis. So uh, I'm working from home and I, I'm sure everybody is at home, right? So uh, India has done a remarkable uh, job by containing its people for three weeks. That's unbelievable. 1.3 billion people unbelievable you guys are doing marvelous just continue to do whatever you're doing just be at home and don't go out and meet the virus that's it just don't go out and meet the virus the virus is not a living thing so it's not going to target you and come in if you do not go out and meet the virus it will not come in so remember a few things which i learned over the period over the uh, last uh, couple of um, days through social media and uh, everywhere else you know like uh, there are a few things we have to uh, understand uh, as far as i'm concerned and um, uh, those are uh, number one uh, uh, you have to um, uh, okay one second let me just fix this okay so uh, number one you have to do remember that your touch that this is this fingers are your greatest enemy now you have to constantly sanitize and constantly wash your hands that you must have known by now even if you are at home wash your fingers every uh, wash your hands up till here or up till here every um, two hours even if you're at home so wash them for 20 seconds and how to wash you have seen the videos but I'll just tell you first you wash your hands like this and then you wash each and every finger okay and like like i heard in one of the videos they say sing the happy birthday to you song twice so i'm singing to myself happy birthday to me happy birthday to me happy birthday dear kabiri happy birthday to me so i'm singing it twice and i'm uh, washing the hands so you have to wash every finger then you have to wash your nails like this you know even like i have this little little uh this kind of nails so i wanted to cut them off but you know you need nails for so many things so uh you have to wash your nails like this go into your nails and wash them like this and uh, like first rub the soap on them and make gather a lather and then you know wash them wash your hands from here from here even if you have rings then wash the rings separately rub the rings uh, rinse the rings separately and then after 20 seconds wash your hands off so it's like you're singing happy birthday to you to me twice so that's the way you have to handle that is number one number two is sanitize like it's my become my big job now like i sanitize everything starting from the let's say the computer keyboard i'm watch, working on so i have to sanitize or spray on the keyboard okay then my mobile phone the one i'm holding right now i i have to sanitize the mobile phone the glasses i take them off and i wash them with soap and water and keep them like this on the on the countertop for five minutes and that let the water get drained off so the glasses are washing them at least twice a day and then all the switches all the thing all the handles door handles door knobs okay so you have to spray them with uh, you know, with any kind of a uh, sanitizer and kind of a disinfectant so i am i have run out of disinfectant so i'm spray i have made a disinfectant with three things uh, vinegar baking powder and common salt these are the th these are very good disinfectants so i made them and also yeah also i used ammonia so uh, it's uh, ammonia there, there are two kind of disinfectants i have with me one is a strong one that is ammonia and vinegar and one is a uh, like a light one which is for the kitchen countertops and you know, all that is made with vinegar common salt and baking powder so there are two kinds of uh, disinfectants you can rewind this and uh, uh, and ch check the and you know see it i'll give it on the link also the two kinds of disinfectant one is the um, vinegar and uh, what did i say ammonia this is one strong one and the the, the subtle the lighter one is vinegar uh, common salt just uh, salt we use and baking powder so you can use any of them as disinfectants and for hand sanitizer if you run out of hand sanitizer there is one very good thing i have uh, i'm using that's aloe vera gel with some alcohol 
so if you have a little bit of alcohol you can buy it from a chemist shop also uh, at least 60 percent above is the alcohol it should be there so you can use aloe vera gel with alcohol and that can get, become a good sanitizer for you okay so and the things that we do have to do in, at home okay let me tell you you wake up in the morning and plan your ahead what you're going to do for the day for the rest of the day like i do one hour of yoga and um, exercises and i watch the news at that time because i have to keep abreast being a journalist i have to keep myself abreast with the news so uh, i'm seeing a little flattening of the curve all over the world just that america is still in denial i mean I shouldn't I'm not political person I don't want to get political and on my channel but America is in denial and uh, I'm I'm in Canada we have closed our borders not so much I mean the the uh, working border is still on so I'm very scared if Canada uh, can able will be able to contain the disease if America the bomb explodes in America America is just sitting on the bomb it's just waiting to be explode exploded so um, guys in America I'm sorry for you that your president is not taking it seriously like Indian governor Indian prime minister has so uh, I'm really feel sorry for you but you voted him to power so there is no way I, we can do anything about it so anyway uh, Canada has taken enough uh, restrictions and everything is closed down everything is under lockdown in Canada too for at least a week and then we go on uh, we decide the next week my uh, our operations are also closed like my job I'm working from home everything I'm doing from home and we are all at home together my husband is with the essential services so he has to go out and when he comes in he's like standing at the gate and I am spraying him and I'm spraying his uh, this is underneath the shoes yes this, that's one of the thing you have to do you have to spray underneath your shoes okay because this is a not a live uh, virus is not live it gets carried by something or the other so if somebody has sneezed somewhere on the road and the virus ha is a little heavier than a normal virus so if it's not in the air if it's dropped down on the ground and you by chance have stepped on it your shoe is going to carry it inside your home so it's it's good that you have to you have to sanitize and spray on your shoes underneath your shoes after you come back from work anyway from anyway even if you have the mask on and the gloves on and mask and gloves are the must i mean you just have to use the gloves wherever you're going because you're opening the doors you're touching something you're touching the handrails so anywhere it can come from anywhere this is a very dangerous virus so try to understand this is a very dangerous uh, enemy we're facing and this is a uh, this is all those movies of catastrophe of apocalypse everything has come together so 2020 we are actually in that middle of that apocalypse that we might have to face so d please don't take it lightly please don't take it lightly it's a very serious thing and we have to uh, we have to fight it together okay so i just hope we uh, wish you guys all the best and uh, we'll keep in touch and give me give me your feedbacks definitely give me all your feedbacks i'll definitely like like to hear them um, but um, yeah keep talk to everybody over the phone over the video call we have video calls and nobody we don't hate anybody but we have to maintain social distancing that is we cannot talk to each other we cannot go into each other's house and we cannot um, no you cannot uh, obviously ha shake hands with anybody or anybody and hug anybody nothing we cannot do okay grocery is another thing which you have to do and if you have to do that grocery please wear your gloves where are you going when you come back home take the bag that you're carrying the grocery with and sanitize it completely sanitize the bag completely first thing when you get back home use the hand sanitizer or use the spray to spray on the bag completely then turn uh, get the vegetables out and vegetables or fruits whatever just wash them very well okay and then put them in the counter wherever you want to put them if it is chicken or if it is fish and you want to put it put it in the deep freeze like this this virus get, cannot survive in too much cold so wash the packet on top very well and then put them in the fridge okay so be uh, follow these guidelines just remember everything has to be washed everything has to be disinfected 
whatever comes into your house, you have to disinfect every. If you can do this, you'll stay off the virus, and nothing can harm you. The virus cannot harm you. If you just do all these things, you have to be very careful. You have to be very, very, uh, like you have to observe everything very well. So take this seriously. Do not let anything elapse you. This virus will not enter your door if you can take these precautions. Okay, thank you so much for watching and do subscribe to my channel. This is the first time I'm saying, but do subscribe to my channel and keep watching. Uh, I'll uh, try to post videos in this time of lockdown. Bye bye. Have a, have a great day. Ho hope to see you and take care of yourself. Be safe. Be happy. Be, be good. Good. Be normal. Do a lot of breathing exercise, a lot of pranayam, a lot of uh, meditation and chalk out your day from the beginning to the end. You'll be happy. You'll see the day passes. Just, just like that. The day will pass. Okay. Have a good day.